This is a 15 and 5. So they've gone old school, so we'll bring the knight out and just support the pawn. And we'll just bring this knight here attacking the queen. Smaller piece attacking the higher piece, can't be wrong. You can envisage it coming back to protect the pawn, so it's uh, come there to protect the pawn either way. Smaller piece attacking the higher piece, looking for a crucial spot here. But you can envisage the queen coming here to support. If it panicked and went here, then we would get a lovely fork. So we'd have the king, yes, yeah, so it's gone there. So we're making the queen work, but are we finding a good position? Um, really want to go on castle, so do we potentially just bring this bishop out? Is it too far? There's no more checks on their queen. Can we improve our position with our queen? No, can we push onto this pawn in the center? Give them something to think about. I think we can do that, just keep it a bit busy or else we're giving them tempo to start developing their pieces so they're attacking our knight this pawn can attack a smaller piece attacking a higher piece if they forget themselves then we can take the queen so again trying to keep it busy trying to give them problems uh, within the answer process but still looking at our position hopefully trying to find a better position all the time whilst we're looking for problems. But to be mindful, the opponent also wants to create problems for us, so we have to look at our blind spots, try not to get tunnel visioned into creating our problems. So the Queen's moved yet again, so they've not developed any more pieces, they've just moved the Queen. Is it improving the Queen's position every time they're making a move? Our Bishop, smaller piece could attack the Queen again, does it have anywhere else to go? Well, let's just attack the queen. So we're thinking it's probably not going there. It's not going to go here because the bishop will take. Probably end up going here with a check on our king. Obviously looking for a queen exchange. But then we would potentially lose the knight because we've still got the pawn on there. So maybe we're just going with a simple defense but then we lose. So we're going to have to bring the knight back to block. So a plus one at the moment, we've got quite a few pieces developed, so we don't need to be greedy when the queen comes across. I don't think going for the queen. Oh, Shabba. Oh, and they've resigned. <laughs> Jump all that thinking and they've jumped right into the pathway of the night. Okay, brilliant game.